Good afternoon. My name is Ryan Christopher G. Pascual from University of the East Manila taking up BSHM. So for today's assessment, we are talking about Singapore. Uh, so let's talk about geography and facts of Singapore. So if we look closely, the island of Singapore somewhat resemble a diamond in terms of shape if you look at it from another angle. Uh, so the country is located in Southeast Asia near Malaysia, Brunei, and Indonesia. Uh, Singapore claimed its independence with the help of the British after the colonization of Japan during World War II. So their independence is way back in 1965. Uh, Singapore was originally a poor country back then during the World War II. However, after their independence with the help of their first prime minister, Lee Kuan Yew, they became one of the wealthiest countries in Asia based on per person capita. So basically, each individual's uh, medyo mayaman or mayaman. Uh, so Singapore is very famous for the symbol of former lion. So it's a combination of what I believe is a mermaid and a lion. Uh, so you can view these statues at the Mer Lion Park. Uh, so the country of Singapore prioritizes its education as well. So the quality of education in Singapore is excellent and their people have been proven to be very knowledgeable and educated as well. Uh, so next let's bring break down the flag of Singapore. So the white, I mean the red, uh, means brotherhood and equality of man. The white part of the flag symbolizes everlasting purity and virtue. And probably my favorite, the crescent-shaped moon symbolizes a young nation towards its ascent. Uh, and also, of course, five stars. So each star represents an ideology, namely democracy, peace, progress, justice, and equality. Uh, next, let's move on to country information. Uh, so the capital of Singapore is Singapore, uh, so the nationality of their people is Singaporeans, and their literacy rate is at 98%, which is very superb. Uh, so their currency is Singaporean dollar. So one Singaporean dollar equates to 37 pesos in the Philippines. Uh, they only have one UNESCO heritage site, which is the Botanical Garden. So the predominant religion in Singapore is uh, Buddhism at 33%, and the, re and the rest is divided among Hinduism, Christianity, and Islam. And next, let's talk about national airlines. So national airlines, so the national flag carrier of Singapore is Singapore Airlines. Uh, visa in Singapore lasts up to 30 days and international visitors are listed as such. And uh, now let's quickly glance at the top destinations and attractions in Singapore. So there's the Orchard Road, Resorts Road, Sentosa, Gardens by the Bay and Botanic Gardens. And once again, thank you.